Yo, what's going on everyone? Back here with another video and it's spring break time, so I don't know what I'm still doing today. Let's get on out of here. So I just got through security here at Dayton International Airport and uh, you know there's a different audience around here when you hear Careless Whisper playing in the background. I mean, I like that song, but why in an airport? I'm just so really excited right now. I'm here at the airport getting ready to fly to Atlanta. So here we go. So I just got to Atlanta, but I still have one more flight to go in order to get to my spring break destination. But that unfortunately involves a concourse change in Atlanta. Yay! And onto the plane we go. You held your breath to up everyone i am here in south carolina and oh, it feels so good to just be on break i mean i love dating and everything but it's nice to get away sometimes so i thought i might as well give you guys a little room tour of my little villa here in uh, south carolina so let's do that so as we come from the entrance here it's actually really nice got a big old mirror right there Hey, there's me. Let's go in here first. Uh, so right here we have a nice little kitchen. Big old fridge. There's silverware and everything. It's really cool. Here we got our little dining room. Love that. Here we got a little living room. Big TV. Big couch. Couple chairs. If we go in over here, this is the master bedroom. This is where my parents will be staying. Nice big old bed. Another TV. Jacuzzi. Another bathroom right in there. And if we come out here, let's go out to the balcony. If, if I can open the door. There we go. Here's our little balcony. We got a table out here. Ooh, it is really nice out. That's actually the first time I've been out because we got in really late last night, so I didn't know how it was. Take a look around. This is really neat. This is a really neat place, let me tell you. And now we come into my room. Yep, there are two beds. My computer's open right there, listening to some music, editing this video. We got a couple beds here. Here's the, uh, here's our bathroom. Big old shower. So there's a little glimpse of my room. Now, what we're gonna do today, I really don't know. I'm on vacation, so really, we're just gonna do what we feel like. So, let's go! Ah, it's such a beautiful day, and, uh, decided to get bikes. Cause why not? I love biking, especially here. This is such a bike friendly island and I just love it. Had a big old burrito for lunch and I mean it was big. Like it's the, almost the size of my head and I have a really big head so that is saying something. First time going to the beach and oh my god it is beautiful. Oh I just love coming here. It's so relaxing. Almost sunset. Just listen to this. Just, just amazing. Honestly, with all the hectic things happening in my life, this is such a huge, huge break. And it's the best break ever. I just love it here. I, I, this, that's probably the millionth time I've said it in this video and probably the millionth and first time I'll ever say it, but I really, really love it here. One million and two. And I mean, it's a perfect time to walk on this beach too because it's like just past low tide. There's so much open space here. I mean, it's 
perfect time. Heck, I could bring my bike out right now and ride because there's so much open sand. That sad moment when you realize you didn't bring a Frisbee. And it's always fun walking through a partially filled tide pool. It's so uneven. Yeah, I'd say that beats Ohio. All right, guys, so we just got back from having some amazing pizza at my favorite pizza place here, Giuseppe's. Shout out to Giuseppe's of Hilton Head. I'm just going to end the night on watching some basketball because I love March Madness and Kansas is playing. I just want Kansas to win. I call them to be na the national champs. Anyway, I'm going to pack it in for the night and I'll see you guys tomorrow. What is up, everyone? Good afternoon. Again, the only reason I say afternoon is just because we had a slow start and I like sleep. Anyway, it's kind of a gloomy day. But that did not stop my family and I from going to our favorite place on the entire island. The Salty Dog Cafe. Not to be confused with the old Salty Dog in Sarasota. Just had some really, really good food there. Had some she crab soup, which, oh, this, the she crab soup here is just amazing. Some of the best soup I'll ever have in my life. And just some good old fashioned fish and chips. Oh, and by the way, I also just got a new shirt. Take a look at it. Oh yeah, I love this. This is gonna be a really nice shirt to wear. Captain Decky reporting for duty. I don't know, I just felt I just felt like trying I just felt like trying it on, because why not? It's always an amazing moment when you have a lot of people passing by you saying go flyers. Flyers are everywhere, man. And I mean everywhere, which is amazing. Go flyers. Tomorrow. Right guys, so it is now Saturday and uh today is just gonna be another day of whatever. Just look, going around a little shopping center and just seeing what we can get. Well, we just shopped at Kroger and I was about to get some frozen yogurt, but uh when there's a Killwinds here, I just have to get it, so let's get some ice cream. Um, yes please. Yeah, sure, it's gloomy outside, but it's another perfect day for a bike ride on the beach. It's about an hour to low tide, so I thought, why not get a little ride in? And it's just perfect time for it. It's not windy, the water's not very choppy, it's perfect. I just gotta watch out for some jellyfish. This is a good spot for jellies to pop up on the shore. So, I mean, <laughs> it wouldn't be a good idea to run over one. Just riding in between the tide pools from high tide and the, uh, the water right now. And it's actually a very, very calming ride. I love this. We seem to have encountered a mild disturbance here. It just started pouring out of nowhere. Look, look, look down there. It's a freaking river down there. Like, what the heck is going on? Like, I just had food at a Greek place on the island and it just started clouding up and we decided to leave. Good thing we decided to leave because it is pouring rain and it just came out of nowhere. Like, I even looked down that way. You can't even see the ocean or you can barely see. Oh my God, I saw that lightning. You can barely see the ocean. I mean, if you try to look, okay. You can see it a little bit, but you can barely see it, man. Oh my god. Right, guys, so that's going to be the end of the footage for today. It's really, really late. I'm really, really tired, if you can't tell. Unfortunately, Kansas lost, which, you know what? <clears throat> I don't really care at this point. Dayton's been out of the tournament since the beginning. Uh, what can I say? This tournament has been full of surprises. But really, all we did after going to the Greek place was seeing all that rain and going to a hot tub after it stopped raining, which was really nice. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Well, this is a perfect way to start off the day. Okay, this is seriously getting annoying now. One eternity later. And once again, the rain has foiled any sort of plans. Like I said before, this is actually getting really annoying now. It's ridiculous how much it's been raining. Well, I guess it's time to strap in and watch some more basketball. It's time for uh, Syracuse and Virginia. To be honest, about all we did was go to the outlets and get a few things, but... Other than that, it's just been rainy all day and we decided not to do anything else. There really wasn't any point. Two hours later. Guys, let me let me let me uh, let me sit down here for a second. Let's let's sit down here. Let me ask you a serious question. On behalf of all Dayton Flyer fans, what just happened? Syracuse just made it to the final four. Are you kidding me? Of all teams, a number 10 seed just made it to the final four over Virginia. Like Oh my god. How did that happen? They were down 14 at the half and they came all the way back. They went on like a 27 to 4 run. Ugh, I know, it's March, but really? Syracuse! Syracuse fans, I'm sorry, but how all this has happened, I have no idea. But on a brighter note, North Carolina won. So there is still a one seed in this tournament. Thank the lord. My bracket is still somewhat intact. But of course I had Kansas winning it all, so they're goes any hopes. Anyway guys, this is sadly the end of my little Hilton Head trip here for my spring break. The next footage you're going to see is going to be from tomorrow morning when I pack it all up and 
head back to Dayton. However, I am not flying back. I am driving back with my parents. It's going to be a lovely 10 hour journey and don't worry, I'll be sure to film that as well. So I'll see you guys tomorrow on the road. All right, guys, it's 7.30, Xavier still sucks, and it's time to get out of here. So let's just get on the road. Of course, it can never be a road trip without going to Cracker Barrel. I love coming in this store. Got the old-fashioned drinks and a lot of candy. My God, they got all the heat stuff too. The only number one seat left. And of course, my mom just had to stop for Starbucks. Shocking. And so here we are, back where it started. Well, I mean, I started the video from across the hall, but you know what? We're back where it started here uh, in my room. So there you have it. There is my little South Carolina adventure that I decided to film a little bit for you guys. I really enjoyed the trip a lot. It was very relaxing. That's why there wasn't a heck of a lot of footage on this video. Anyway, if you want to see any future videos I have and know when they come up, make sure you subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. Leave a like if you liked it. Comment below things that you like to comment. I don't know. Just do whatever the heck you want. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one.